for the other laymen out there, about six billion of them, what does this mean? Uh, we've, we've heard that uh, if it is the Higgs, it explains why we have mass. Is that your best shorthand explanation for the rest of us of what this means? And if, if we didn't have an explanation, and, and did we really not have an explanation before this of why we had mass? I think uh, I first have to correct, with all respect, with uh, Peter Hicks and the other co theory colleagues here, it's not what gives you the mass. That's different. That's a different mechanism. But this, if it's a Higgs boson, what this Higgs boson would tell us is that there is a certain field out here, everywhere, a certain field through which the fundamental particles, like the quarks, the bosons, get their mass. It's not that you get your mass. How can you imagine that this thing works? Well, you take a large room with journalists, okay? And they are all equally distributed in the room. This is the field which would give mass to, to elementary particles through the interaction of these particles with the field. Somebody who is completely unknown to the journalists can go through this field through the journalists with speed of light. That means that person would have zero mass. The more known you are, yeah, the more journalists are clustering around you. That means you get slower, you don't reach the velocity of light, you acquire mass. The better known you are to the journalists, the more massive you are, okay? You saw this when you were coming in here, yeah? Peter Higgs, Peter Higgs was pretty heavy, <laughs> huh? Okay? Now that doesn't tell you anything about this boson yet. But this field, as the journalists, obviously, has an interaction in between itself, and this self-interaction can produce this Higgs boson. How can I imagine that? Imagine I open the door and I whisper a rumor into the room. Then the journalists are curious, they cluster. What did he say? This cluster of journalists is a Higgs boson. That's easy. <laughs> That's particle physics for laymen without a single equation. Yeah, that's very, very good, thank you. But to the extent that I am to the extent that I am made of fundamental particles, uh, does this not have any relevance to me? I think it has a lot of relevance to you because if that would not exist, I think uh, you would not exist. I think that's in a very short layman term. You agree? Yes, absolutely. Okay. Okay, I got agreement.